Casper City staff continue preparing for the 2017 solar eclipse. Eclipse Festival staff hosted success on the center line in downtown Casper. News 13's Tyler Wagenspach takes a look into it. Casper is expecting large crowds for next year's eclipse. The historic event only lasts two and a half minutes. Anna Wilcox, the Wyoming Eclipse Festival director, says the symposium helps Casper get ready. We're providing a service information by bringing in experts, both experts on eclipse as well as experts on events, event planning, how to build your city to accommodate a huge influx of people. One guest speaker even gave advice on making those accommodations, such as eating, housing, and entertainment. The eclipse puts Casper in the spotlight. Casper is going to be the focus of, of our country, and next summer it's going to be one of the best places in America to watch the eclipse. The eclipse hasn't come through in about 30 years, so it's going to be a spectacular event. A small town like Casper is going to take a population and probably double or possibly triple it. Which is why Wilcox says businesses are planning for it right now. And the types of things that we want to bring to the community of Casper over the next year to make sure that everyone is fully prepared for what we're about to embark on. Of course, it will take work and it will take preparation. And those people who are starting and thinking about it now, they're definitely going to be ahead of the game. Tyler Wagenspeck, News 13, Casper. The Eclipse Festival takes place next August and is expecting nearly 50,000 tourists.